What's going on, good people? Um, today I want to talk about just analog synth versus soft synth. Um, I've probably been playing with the sequential. I probably had it. I've had it over a week. Um, and even before I was making videos, I was just playing with the patches and like you know dealing with some of the oscillators, like say, changing the waves. You know, because you got sawtooth, you got saw triangle, you got triangle, you got pulse. Um, and just you know trying different combinations, playing with some of the low frequencies. Um, starting to play with a little bit of the effects and opening up some more of the filters and stuff down on this end and just you know playing with the oscillators and just trying to come up with something new i know today i'm gonna dive into um you know making some tracks with it and my mpc um 3000 and my asr just to see if i can just you know try to make a dark a dark type of um a dark type of sound but i will tell you guys it's a major difference like even outside of like the sonic you know like the sonic the sound the texture you know being thick like just these sounds have more of a, a character you know than what's inside the computer and then you know we always talk about how the computer sound you know is much cleaner and lighter and you know with this it has weight and i do not want to um forget to mention that i'm running this through the fat so and the fat so if the fat so by empir empirical labs i want to make sure i'm saying it right um it's just warming up the sound even more and it's giving it weight and like the few tracks that i've made with this setup like it's been a, my music has been sticking out more not even like the musicality or like what's going on but just the actual overall sound like you know these are some weird and wacky sounds and then you can kind of like sculpt them and make them even your own and even more um or what have you so it's just a different bop man so i encourage you guys man like hit the link in the description and just go to the sounds page and just look at some of the synthesizers like it doesn't have to be a profit like they have various different ones man but like really getting your hands on the synthesizer and like just trying it like you will really like i don't want to say change your sound but you can take your sound to a whole another level because like you can even throw this in with some of your soft sims you know what i'm saying like the basses that come out of this like how everybody be like man i need my bass to drive and sound away like man these keyboards like the bass patches that they have in there even like some of the like synths like you can play them down in lower octaves and start like adding like noise with the noise button or you know like playing with the shape mod and like changing the oscillator to like you know get around the sound like in the shape and the wave like you can really create some some textures in here to like combine with what you already got with the computer like this can really make your sound this can really make your sound ring off and like i said it doesn't have to be the sequential per se but like just incorporating even like a micro core or like you know some other type like i even have a you know a small one behind me like a gaia you know what i'm saying like just you know those are cheaper you know cheaper cheaper boards but still have the same purpose and the gaia actually has like a lot of oscillators and stuff on there that you could play with as well to um you know to help you manipulate but like I'm not even dived in all the way in this thing, man. I'm just, like I say, I'm surface level, probably like 25% in, and I'm like, damn, we can do some crazy stuff, make some crazy. I'm just, I'm just becoming big, like on, on just textures, and you know, not having to use a lot of sounds, but just using sounds with purpose. Like that's what I'm really trying to, you know, dive in on, and you know, having older keyboards, like it'll really, you know really help you do that so i'm telling you guys man hit the link in the description box man check the good old people out at z zounds man just go through go through and see what all type of boys they have it's about dixie man here for me right here with georgia muscle music right now see right here we got something called the muscle fat you know what i'm saying so the drums i'm finna be using today this is where they come from so so this volume one, let's see what they sound like. You know what I'm saying? Shit, I like right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on, everybody?
everybody. Do you guys need music equipment? Well, guess what? In my description box, there's a link to my Zounds account. And at Zounds, you guys can get all the equipment in my studio and more. And guess what? You don't have to have all the money up front. They can spread the payments out over 12 months and they're not doing no background or no credit check. All you need is your debit card and ID and you good from there. Man, y'all check them out. Go get some new stuff so you can make some new sounds.